So today's new build is a small castle at uh, 5,500 square feet, and we're gonna cover some electrical stuff today. Um, this electrical is shockingly bad on this new build. Get it? Okay, so if you can see behind me on this cover plate, there's a lime green sticker, and what that is is that is uh, City of Houston, in this case, we're out in the Katy, so it's the City of Katy uh, Code Inspectors. And what they come in and do is supposed to check each specific system, in this case electrical, and make sure it's up to code. But according to this code inspection sticker, this electrical is up to code and all performing as intended. Not so much. So let's check it out. So first we're gonna start at the panel boxes and at first glance, the wiring seems to be good. We have main panel here, sub panel here. They got the sub panel wired properly so that all looks good. So we're gonna close in and see on this breaker, you can see right here that they've already damaged the wire sheathing coming out of the breaker. That's gonna expose that wire and uh, could be a potential arc issue. As we go up to the bonding screw, which is this green screw right here, you can see there's already burn marks and arc damage. So obviously something is not uh, working right in this electrical panel box. Um, I'm gonna go around to the outside. Now as home inspectors, we are not code inspectors. And so, um, but I do know on a new build, you're supposed to have every single uh, exterior outlet. It's supposed to be GFCI protected, so it trips when it uh, detects a uh, interruption in the circuits. And not a single one of the outlets that I tested trip properly. So let me show you. So they do have the weather cover, which is good. So let me open this up. And I'm going to plug in my outlet tester. Okay, so we know the outlet's working. It's got the lights, and when I press this button right here, my outlet tester, it's supposed to turn the outlet off. And as you can see, it is not turning off. So that is not wired properly. And like I said, there's probably uh, about 10 outlets around this whole exterior of this home, and not a single one of them tripped properly. So according to the code inspector for this house, everything is good, but we know that's not the case. So thanks for watching, and I'll catch you on the next one.